Hi, I'm GMG. I am going to tell you a little bit about how to add feeds to the Vivaldi mail and feeds reader. So uh, if I am just, let's say I am browsing online, I go to vivaldi.com or any other website, I see this little icon up in the corner. It is your feeds icon and I can either preview or subscribe. So if I preview, I will go to see the overview of what I'm subscribing to and then I just click subscribe. I can either add the feed to update every hour or 15 minutes, but hour is plenty for it in this case. And so I just add a feed. It will pop up in my under my feed section in my mail panel. And there is also a dedicated feeds panel here on the side. So, um, okay, if I go to TechCrunch here, I see the feed icon pop up right here. I can subscribe to the comments feed or just the regular feed and click subscribe and boom, there we have it. And I have a list of feeds right here. If you already know where the feed URL, you can just like let's say wired.com slash feed. Um, you can just copy paste the feed or add it manually. Uh, put a title here, wired all latest, and then the address and update every five minutes. And it's already added in your feeds panel. So the feeds will also show up in your mail and they will show up under your all message section and the feed section. And within your all message section in the unread, you, if you don't want this to happen, you can simply toggle off show feeds and they will all disappear from that section. Uh, also like within here, the feeds, uh, you can right click on a feed and mark everything is read if you're overflowed with feeds already that you don't want to deal with and the same can be done within the feeds panel. All the same shortcuts work within mail as feeds and so you can reply or forward the feed or uh, compose a new message from within there or do whatever you want. Add maybe a flag or a label uh, or throw it away or put it in trash or move to folder, whatever you want. Uh, if you are already uh, like some YouTube channels, you can subscribe to them. Uh, but for that, you usually need to uh, make, an, uh, make a YouTube account. Now, uh, with the Vivaldi Feed Reader, you do not have to. So if you go to an account uh, and click their video page, You'll see up in the corner here next to the URL that uh, the page offers feeds. So you can simply just click subscribe and there it will pop up straight in your feeds panel and you can watch videos from that feed straight in your mail client. Now this allows you to not have to go to YouTube every time you want to watch videos or want to see what is published and also it's, it's a non-tracking YouTube URL and therefore it won't track anything until you press play. Um, so therefore you get extended privacy and right from within your mail client. If you use another client or, or some feed client like Feedly or something, you can export your uh, feeds into a file, an OPML file. And from there, you can go into Vivaldi and you can click import from applications or files, choose feeds, OPML file, and then you can choose a file, select your Feedly file and open. And there, boom, you have all your feeds right in one place and then you can add them all and update them daily or whichever you want. And they'll pop right in there. That makes it a lot easier to add a whole bunch of feeds that you've 
masked from over time. So hopefully that makes it much easier to switch and to update your feeds from it within Vivaldi. So that was how to subscribe to feeds and hopefully you can subscribe to as many feeds as you want. Thank you.